Transportation challenges create one of the most daunting barriers to health care, a barrier second only to the cost. But through a network of volunteers, Angel Flight West has actually given tens of thousands of patients one less thing to worry about so they can focus on more important things like getting better. Like any child, Audrey is fascinated with flying. At just 11 months old, she is no stranger to the friendly skies. Unfortunately, because of a rare liver disorder, she has traveled more than most kids will their entire childhood. Uh, Audrey is on anti-rejection medication because of her liver transplant, and so as a result, her immune system is compromised. Hey. <laughs> we made it! All right. <laughs> Full disclosure here. Good, how are you? My brother Scott. Karen is my sister. Audrey is my niece. And earlier this year, we found out Audrey needed a life-saving liver transplant. And the best place for her wasn't in her hometown of Tucson, Arizona, but the Children's Hospital of Colorado in Aurora, 900 miles away. We drove to Colorado um, for her transplant. It was about a 15 hour drive and drove back as well three months later. After making a couple of trips to Colorado in the car with mom and dad, Audrey and family finally climbed on board Angel Flight. I've been flying for 20, 22 and a half years, uh, and I've been flying for Angel Flight for about eight years. Button is one of nearly 3,000 volunteers, including pilots and Earth Angels, people who provide ground transportation once the precious cargo lands, working for Angel Flight. You know, just how amazing, not just the flying aspect can be, but then you combine that with the, the humanity of just being able to help somebody else in, in a desperate circumstance. The pilots not only volunteer their time, but also their plane. It's service work, and it makes me feel useful. That's why I do it. It's such a generous community, and I'm continually surprised at pilots' willingness to donate their time, pay for the fuel, donate their aircraft, and really go out of their way to just make a difference in someone else's life. In almost 40 years of service, Angel Flight West has taken off on 94,000 missions, serving 20,000 passengers. Angel Flights West is a is a blessing, really, because they they flew us here um, safely and generously at no cost to us at all. <laughs> With all the complications Audrey has had, her mom and dad have had to return to Colorado a few more times than expected. Karen's a teacher and had to take leave of absence without pay this entire school year. Audrey's dad's also an educator on a limited budget. It's also helpful financially because, as you can imagine, we have a lot of medical bills. Although Audrey will likely require a lifetime of medical attention, the family doesn't foresee any more angel flights in the near future. And hopefully the next visit to Colorado will be for vacation to see Uncle Scott. My niece, Audrey, is actually doing fine after her latest procedure. She will actually celebrate her first birthday next month with mom and dad at the comfort of her own home. And by the way, Angel Flight West has also raised over $6 million to host children and patients at summer camps and their families, as well as help pay for other unforeseen costs. Now, if you'd like to donate, we'll have that information on our website at fox21news.com.